<laughs> Yo, what is going on guys? It is Nick, also known as Daddy Sniper, and we're back here with a different sort of video for the YouTube channel. I'm here with Ethan, also known as Eggnog, as you guys may know. Um, but we're doing uh, a Q&A slash KFC mukbang. We've got a massive uh, KFC box. And uh, yeah, we're gonna, we got uh, four Zinger burgers, so two, for, two each. We've got a supercharged slider each. And then we've got two large chips. And then we've got a large solo to be shared. Um, so yeah, it's going to be good. We're going to munch this down. And then we're going to go through the questions you guys have given us. Alrighty. Question one. Are you gay? <laughs> um, you know, I don't, I don't sometimes, I don't think. I live with the boy. <laughs> Only with the boys. That's it. But I yeah. yeah. But I Holy fuck. What about you? Like, like only if there's an umbrella above my head. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Alright. Okay. Mm. Next question. Okay. This one's specifically from a good viewer. Okay. How did it feel when you ate your hamster's left nut live on stream? Tell us about that. Break that down. So, this one was actually about two years ago. When I was... Alright. Would you rather mm. lick the inside of someone's nose or uh -huh. the inside of someone's ear? Ooh. I'm thinking ear. Wait. Right. Look, the inside of someone's nose or inside of someone's ear. I guess it's no, like... No, but like, is this like, are we talking like a dirty ear or are we just talking like the average human? I guess we're talking like the average ear, but the average nose always got shit. Because if you're thinking how far can you stick a tongue in? Like, like but it's going to be a good lick. Then you got to get your tongue as far in as you can. Okay, but like, is it, but like, it could be like, is it a lick that's like, sure it's a good lick, but like, what happens if it's like a second? Or does it have to be like a good five seconds? It's like, if you had to scrape stuff out, you choose an oh. ear or a nose, the scraper. But eating, I guess eating boogers is like typical. I mean, kids do that more often, don't they? Maybe boogers. I would say maybe licking the nose. I, well, I don't know, but I don't think I'd throw up. But then, ah, oh, yeah. Because we're talking like Ben for 20 years. They're crusty, right? Yeah, I'd rather a napper's nose after a Ben for 20 years. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I agree. I reckon I'm going with a nose. I go with an ear. You go there? Yeah. Guys, let us know in the comments, would you rather lick a person's no inside their nose or in their ear? But like, full on lick. That's a good question. Good lick. What was the moment you realised you genuinely enjoyed streaming? Um, that's a good question. I think like, when I found out I enjoyed streaming, it was, uh, it's always been, I've always enjoyed it since the start, but the point where it got exciting or it, there was a change is, I guess, after I became affiliated, but then also there was that exponential change in growth. So like, you know, when I switched to Minecraft and doing privates and all that, that's where I got a lot more interactive with my viewers and stuff and there was a lot more happening. So I feel like that was the, the turning point. Yeah. What about for you? So, because you now stream. Twitch.tv slash eggnog19. No, it takes seven days to get affiliate. On the seventh day, I was an affiliate. Mm. You know, that's just how it is. You're just too good. You you know, we play Minecraft every night almost. We play it for two weeks straight. Now everyone's angry at me because I haven't played Bed Wars in a night. So <laughs> just one night. One when night. can we expect you next? Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. So, depending on when this video comes out, I've probably already streamed. He's probably already streamed, or it might come out quickly, so you don't know. But never know. You never know. You never know. I kind of want to change my top, like my stream stuff. I mean, we've talked about this on stream, but I don't know. I think this is kind of on the the downfall. I feel. Hmm. We need Australian high pixel. Australian high pixel. That's true. I'll invest if someone makes that. Yeah. Um, Oh. Yeah. Yeah, we finished at the same time. 
Bro, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get shit my pants already. No, don't fart, dude. No, it's not a fart. Oh, are you shooting yourself? <clears throat> um, refill? Question. Oh. Are we expecting a horror game soon? Um. I don't know. I mean, I was, sure, I was meant to do some over Halloween, but I didn't. Oh, actually, yeah. Apart from Faz, I did a bit of Phasmophobia. But yeah, I don't know. I kind of I kind of want to do more Phasmophobia streams. They're kind of fun. I need to play horror. They're so scary. Mm. Do you need to play... Say, I don't know, like... Would you play, like, a campaign? Like, yeah. I mean, have you ever played Outlast? I haven't played anything. Oh, Outlast is good. That's, a good. That's the one I started on. Like, for my streams, I started on Outlast. Like, Outlast is really good. It's scary. Yeah, oh yeah, that'll get you, like, chasing and all that. But I get scared enough when it's pacify. <laughs> so, alright. But yeah, horror game, I don't know, I don't know if there'll be a set one, but Phasmophobia probably, uh, probably soon. Question. Yeah. Why are you Australian? Uh, good question. Um, I actually don't know, I'm still trying to figure that one out myself. Um, probably, I don't know, about when I was born here, that's all I know. Follow up. Right. When are we moving to the UK? Good question. We will move, um, when Ben decides to lose, um, 20 kilos. I don't know. Oh, yeah, well then there'd be room in his house. Yeah, and then you won't eat all our food. Because the thing is, if we went there, obviously Ben's going to move in. But all the food's going to be gone. We're going to have to shop every four hours. Yeah. Yeah, not even daily. We wouldn't even hours. need to unpack the food. <laughs> you get home, you go to take a piss, you come back, even the fucking bags are gone. Yeah. So, mm. when, when that happens, mm, that's when we move. Mm. Ten minutes later. Mm. I was banging down the large double quarter pound of milk from McDonald's. How much? Was it, it surely it was on the Macca's app. So, I got this trick. You make a couple emails, and you sign up to Macca's on different emails. Wow. Every day you go on the app, and there's a different deal on each account. Right. And you sift through it. You don't want a, double, sink, a one dollar cheeseburger? Yuck. You know, 20% off your order. Now we're talking. That's good. Add 20% off. Large double quarter pound of meal, large Big Mac meal, twenty bucks flat. Oh, that two, that double quarter pounder is so much protein. I shit eight times in the next four hours. We do that anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers to that. Wait, checking that supercharge as well. Cause you need the supercharge. Yeah, I need supercharge for it. Supercharge is gonna make me explosion. I'm just like check. No, no, switching, switching. I knew, but... Are you sure? Wait, there's orange on it. Oh, it is. <laughs> you did get it. It's a super charge. <laughs> Give me that shit, bro. <laughs> Take that away from me. Did you see that? He tried to steal the super charge. Bro, bro, you had it first. He gave it to you me. You had it first. No, man, you had it. Oh. Eat your greens, kids. Bro, I didn't realize KFC makes me feel dusty. And then oh. that just makes you fucking sick on my Yeah, true. Alright, so second Zinger burger in. I slide it down. And, um... And some questions. And some questions. Alright. What's next on the list? Why did you start streaming? Mm. Um... I actually don't know. I, well, I do, but, like, I don't. So, like... I remember when I started streaming, I was uh, I was doing um, I was studying biomedicine in university for my first first couple weeks, and uh, I was like really keen on becoming a doctor, and that was like probably a total of like eight years worth of study, like including the future courses and all that. And after I um, decided what I wanted to do which wasn't that, I dropped out after two weeks and then I was like, I saw a lot of streamers at the time and 
at the time, like, there was still a lot of people, but Twitch was very different to what it looks like now. Like, there was no channel points. There was Really? No, yeah. Like, dude, it was like... Uh, I can probably put a picture up on screen of, like, what the front page looked like. But, um... What's it called? I'll show you later. But it just it was very, like, uh... I don't know how to describe it. It looked very, like, 2012 kind of sort of vibes. Like, I don't know. Like, it got, even though it, that was like end of year 12 it looked very 2012 like it looked a bit outdated you know mm. and um yeah i don't know it was it was very weird but you know why i why i started streaming just like i just thought it was cool and like i watched a lot of streamers and like not big streamers like small streamers i just like saw something i was like oh I, actually there was this guy and i i do know his name but like i mean i don't actually know him i, I never even actually talked to him in his chat but i remember this actually and i was like i want to start streaming and I want to be bigger than this guy. And, like, there was nothing wrong with the guy. Like, he was fine. Um, like, he's, like, chill. I don't, even, I don't think he still... I don't think he streams, actually, anymore. I haven't seen him pop up in my list. But I followed him because that... The way I saw it was, I want to beat him. By the way, don't have that mindset because you should always be challenging yourself. Don't challenge yourself against others. Like, sure, you can, but it's not a good mindset. you get trapped in that sort of, like, mindset thing. Perfect. All right. Um. Yeah. So. Yeah. So pretty much, and then I just kept working at it, and then you know this is where I am now. So it's pretty cool, pretty impressive, and to us, I never expected to get this far. But yeah, that's why I started streaming on Twitch, and hopefully, uh, keep going for a while and keep growing. Yeah. Why'd you start? I needed Bevel's teammates. You start streaming, you accumulate teammates, you don't lose. You know, and, um... I need to eat, man. I'm about to sh- I'm about to blow. <laughs> don't! Not on here! And, and, I stream to eat. Last night, we had the cake- the other night we had the cake stream. Mm. It was the 14th day in a row anniversary of two weeks. Bro, I watched the bod back, but I wasn't, because that's when I was sleeping. Because I came in, I remember I came in, and then, that was, just, that was when you switched to COD, right? And your stream fucked up, right? <laughs> but dude, I was on the bod back, and I think I was on call with naps or something. Bro, you ate half the cake. You ate half the, what the fuck's wrong with you? So next night, listen. No, no, wait, what happened, why'd you eat half the cake? Well, no. no, no, no. <laughs> Where did it go? Bro, you're fat. So, next night, we had a night off streaming. Hmm. But Blob was online, and I was online, so we wanted to play a game of high pixel. Nah. I grabbed that cake, bro. I had the camera on me. Within forty-five seconds flat, that fucking thing was gone. The other half. The other half, the entire half, using a knife and fork. I cut it up, and I just started funneling. Oh, crazy! Off stream. No. Oh, yeah, 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 off stream. So Blob got premium content. Anyway. She got premium content. Um. Oh. Maybe tomorrow on stream, more Ben and Jerry's. Ben and Jerry's. Mm. Bro, you want more than me. <laughs> You're that bad. Um, if Maxi One's on sale, maybe we do a four Maxi One stream. You know? If we're streaming for two hours, no, if we stream for two and a half hours, at every 30 minute increment, we eat a Maxi One. I think that's a good idea. Just for no reason? Mm. Fair enough. It's for the, it's for the stream, you know? Um. I mean, you know, that makes sense. Just gotta do it for the stream. What's the, um, the 200 follower special gonna be? I might try a back foot, like IRL. On the bed or not on the bed? Oh, like, off the bed, onto the floor, into the gaming chair, and then into a bed wall match. So, it's basically... That's doable. Picture this. I'd be on my bed, I'd do a back, a double backflip, mm -hmm. land in the chair, and as I'm landing, my thumb comes down to press right click to press go into game on Bed Wars. That's good. Um, if you can do that, I'll pay for you $100. I'll try my best. I'll, I'll do some practicing. Um, you know, the minute of silence really helps, but that's at the end, so I can't really hype me. I'm going to have to do a pre-silence minute. That's a good idea. Pre-silence. Um, Have like a countdown. I'm about to throw out right now. 
I'm just gonna fucking project all oh, the into the into the camera. For content. Guys, pretty much, because Egg added an extra slider to this box, the chips are cold, and I don't. That's fucked, cunt. Why'd you launch that at me? <laughs> oh, cunt! Stop. He just. Did you hear that? I can't smell it, thank God. Not yet. Yeah, <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Alright, mm. what's the next question, kid? Anyway, the chips got cold, and uh, I don't, I can't eat, like, I hate cold, like, food like that. It makes me sick. I, I could just warm it up, but I don't, I don't want to. Alright. Alright. How did you get into video games? Uh, oh, actually, I know this. I played, uh, COD when I was, like, six years old, next to my dad. That, that's literally it. I played it, and then ever since I've played video games. And Need for Speed. Need for Speed was good, I think. No, like, as in, yeah, Need for Speed was the other game. And I think Pokemon. Bro, when I was six, I was, like, playing in the dirt. <laughs> yeah, I was on the sticks, bro. I was on the 360, bro. Sticks. Yeah. Bro, I was playing Halo. I was playing, like, all the games. Far Cry, like, two... A couple years later, I copped a PS3, jumped on Black Ops 2, and that was it. It was all over. Dominated. In domination. And I got my first K9 unit on Mirage. The first DLC pack. Yeah, I chinned everyone. Yeah, you just, you got like triple the amount, on any amount, even overflow. No question. Have you ever had social anxiety? Um... I, I wouldn't say social anxiety. I don't think I've ever had, like, anxiety. Because I feel like anxiety is, like, a... Like, that's, like, a medical, like, thing, right? Like, I don't know. Mm. Like, I mean, like, anxiety, like... There's levels. There's levels. Yeah, perhaps anxiety doesn't go under that medical level. When I get anxiety... I don't know. How do I overcome it? Cop it on the chin? Yeah. I mean, um, like... Yeah, it depends. Like, for me... Uh... Like, I've had, oh, everyone's obviously had their down points, but I've never, I don't think I've had the point to, I don't really class it in, as anxiety. I'll just be like, you know, I've just had, like, down points, and I've, like, I've just overcome it. Mm. Um, but it depends how you work. Like, I'm very self-motivated, so I, like, I just kind of distract myself and do my own thing. Um, and streaming and YouTube and all this is kind of an outlet for me. Um, and, you know, I can do whatever I want. So that's why I really like it. And that's why I'm doing it full-time right now. Um, so, yeah, it's... You know, I haven't really, I wouldn't say I've experienced anxiety, or maybe I have, social anxiety, but um, I used to be very introverted, and I got a lot more extroverted just by meeting more people, and, you know, Ethan farting and all that, so, yeah, yeah. yeah. so, yeah, I don't know, I, I would say, like, I've had my down points, definitely, in life, and, like, my childhood, but, um, yeah, it all goes better, as long as you have, like, if you have, if you have a hobby, like, that's, like, you know, focus on that hobby and just do that, if you do experience that, um, but, yeah. I think streaming is a really good outlet. Oh, 100%. Because it allows you to be anti-social while being more social than ever, inviting people in. Yeah. Chatting, communicating. I mean, it will help you, like, get more confident. Mm. Like, just in general. So, you know, if you if you have that social anxiety, it will help you be social, even though in real life, like, meeting people um, is different sort of social... Uh, skills it's it, it will, it's the basis it's a good starting point so yeah hopefully that helps you mm. alright go you go nah oh, I can't I need, a, I need the you need the what what do you mean with a would you rather you just have to make it up oh yeah make it up alright uh would you rather oh, okay I got a good one would you rather yeah so would you rather shit yourself um anytime in your workout in the gym right or would you rather have to cage fight 10 orangutans daily for two minutes so like you absolutely like, hands down shit myself in the gym and why not the Don't, cage it, fight just one of them bro they're feral that would be the living you wouldn't even last two minutes like you wouldn't make it to the no, next but day like, the orangutans like you just like throw them like some snacks no, or something. They got long arms. Yeah, true. I guess like imagine twenty long orangutan arms coming for you. 
Yeah, that's a lot of arms, actually. Yeah, true, that's a good point. Yeah. I can cop a shit. But, like, you, like, let's say you're doing bench here, you're, like, you're laying there, and then fucking shit just comes out your shorts, bro. I think it is what it is. I'll wear adult diapers. And if it was busy as the other day, no, you can't wear diapers, like, it just happens. Like, you have to let it, you have to firm it. And, like, when the shit is done, like, you have to finish the workout. Like, you can't go clean up. Like, it's there. And it smells. Like, it stinks. I don't know. I feel like you just die if you do the orangutan, so... I mean, you only gotta fight... Like, you only gotta fight them for two minutes every day. Ten of them. Bro, they're just like mini gorillas. <laughs> yeah. They're you, you no, they're big. They're not mini. Yeah, they're strong. They swing around and they're on Okay, but the thing is, they swing around. You can just run along on the ground for two minutes. You just had a cage fight. Uh, I get, yeah, I did, I guess. I mean, how big of it? Are we talking like Melbourne Zoo cage? It's big, I guess it's a big Yeah, cage. we're talking a big cage. Like, there's ten of them. Oh, maybe then. Like, you can, like... I said a cage fight because you're in the cage, but it, you don't have to fight them. Uh, you yeah. You have to survive for two minutes. You're going to survive. Oh, well, maybe that's fine then. But, like, they're, they're ten... Like, their mindset is, I want to kill you. And you're going to do that... So you wake up and that's the first thing you have to do every morning. Like, you just teleport in the zoo. Do I get to have a blue bee first? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, oh, that's fine. That's okay. fine, bro. That's a ju- imagine shotgunning a blue bee. You have to shotgun it. Yeah, you know yeah. Sip it. I don't think you could sip it. Like, you need that energy. Yeah, true. That's. All right. Right. Would you rather Bed Wars solos or Bed Wars teams for the rest of your life? Mm, bed Wars teams, yeah. Because I do like 4v4s all the time. To- like, 4v4s, like, yeah, all the time. I would say solo, but, bro, I just don't lose in teams. Uh, true, yeah, you got stick to carry. Got, I got the guys, yeah. I got Pascal. Pascal and Stick were with me the other night. It was me, Pascal, and Griff. Stick, and Griffin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Half the time, Stick says, I know that person, huh? And then, hey, oh, what? fold. They say fold. The like, if he sees someone really good, because he knows people, he says fold. And then Pascal just talks in chat and says, I'm Pascal, and people leave. And Griff says nothing and no one Griff leaves. goes in the corner and cries. Yeah, that sounds good. And I just... You just let that. I have to commentate. You just, yeah. Would you rather have unlimited KFC so you could eat as much, like, any time as much as you want? Sick. Or unlimited Nando's? What do Nando's do other than chicken? Well, what does a KFC do other than chicken? It's the same thing. You know what I mean? I feel like I'd have to choose KFC for the meme. Yeah. I mean, KFC's pretty good. But the thing is, I'm thinking, right, because gym, bro, you get good chicken in there. You get that grilled chicken. At Nando's or KFC? Nando's. Oh. I mean, you sure, you can get grilled chicken in KFC, but it's, you know, it's KFC. Like, KFC is good. But the thing is, think about it. If you have KFC, like, let, let, let's just say you haven't, like, I just said you an infinite supplies, so you don't have to have it. But, like, if you're having it every day, let's say, right. for the year. You'd be fucked up. Yeah, KFC, you're, bro, you're not going to leave the shit out. You're going to have the, the burning hole ring of death on your arsehole. You'd end up pretty boring because it'd get to a point where Zinga Burgers would just mess you up. Yeah. So you'd have to just keep having an original recipe. That could get boring. Yeah, and Nando's, bro, they've got chicken, they've got rice, they've got, like, fucking... Rice is big. Rice is good. Um, They've got fucking, like, halloumi. They've got fucking garlic bread. All right, yeah, Nando's. Like, better. they've got, like, I'm everything. on Nando's side now. I don't know if they have desserts though, but then KC don't really have desserts, do they? No. Dude, remember when KC had crushes? What happened to those? They were selling. Uh, why, why do they get rid of the shit that's good? They were selling. That's good. It was like a McDonald's frappe, but better. Alright, would you rather... You Okay, preface. You're in Ben 20's, Ben 420's bedroom. Do you sleep in top bunk or bottom bunk? Have Just to take notice. The, I have to take the top. Notice, there, if you go on the bottom, there is a fucking chance that it's crashing on you. Yeah, I'm, that's why I said top. But that's why I said top. if you're on top, bro, his hands are sliding up there every night. Like, he's going to start fucking going, like, the, like, you know what I mean? Grabbing you like that. True. And you might start kicking you from underneath. <laughs> yeah. You might go into the roof. His foot might go through the mattress. You think he's, he might not be able to reach, though, because he's, like, four foot two. He was climbing up the ladder. Bro, his legs are too small for that. Oh, actually, but maybe not. Well, if you put a padlock on the ladder, you can't get it. The thing is... Yeah, what? 
Every time you climb up that ladder, there's gonna be a six point zero magnitude earthquake going off. What well, depends if he falls on? <laughs> it doesn't need so to. So if you push him off, bro, the house is coming down anyway. <laughs> so I guess the choice doesn't really matter because regardless, within two hours, the entire building is crashing. <laughs> Why is it a bunk bed? Is is that just the choice? It's a small room. It is what it is. Oh, I'll take it top, because yeah, I just gotta hope you can't climb. That's it. All right. Well, on that note, Ben four twenty. Um, we're gonna end the video there. You know, we've answered all your questions. We did some extra would you rather's, um, and all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to smash that like button. Leave a comment down below. Um, if you guys want to see another video like this, maybe with someone else, maybe with more people, um, maybe something similar. You know, this is something different. You know, I wanted to try. Um, but yeah. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're trying to go for uh, 400 subscribers. We're just shy of 350, I think. Um, so make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this mug man. Uh, love you all, and we'll see you on the streams. Otherwise, we'll see you uh, on Eggnog stream. Yeah. Um, and yeah, that's it. It's been Nick, also known as Daddy Sniper. Ethan, also known as Eggnog. And uh, see you guys soon. Peace out. Yeah. <sighs>